Oh, they made the stream bar small. Oh, that's very nice. All right, well, there's my stream. <clears throat> uh, dashboard, not channel. Right, manage stream. There we go. Okay. E. Okay. Um, hi, uh, I don't know how to pronounce your username, because I am stupid. Yeah, sure, I'll give you a follow. Why not? Get to your profile to follow, though. The f I'm I'm honestly lost here. How how do I get to your channel to follow? What the f I'm really bad at this. Also, yeah, I'm just straight up ignoring that guy who messaged me in game. Oh, here we go. Now I'm going to. Just kind of sitting here and
Okay. Okay, there we go. Oh, shit. There's a person Okay. Traffic jam. <laughs> what are those hit boxes? I love doing that to NPCs. Okay. If I crash, it's because I'm looking at my chat feed to see if anybody says anything, even though there's a singular person. <laughs> okay, that wasn't that. I'm. That's just me being a bad, bad at driving. do that got me in half health oh right firefight like an hour ago Going to have a good week, boss? Anything you need, boss. I really hate all these piles of money in the office. It's just why does it exist? <laughs> Veriline. I've never heard of that car before. You do know that I've got two degrees, both in finance. Oh, hi. Yeah, and I pay what you two fifty a day. You, you got a nice you're week, boss. earning a fucking decent ass wage here. Shut up. Mm, what do I want to drive? No this problem. Way? I'll have your personal vehicle brought around. You're looking very sharp, boss. You won't be able to drive this one out of there. It's heading offshore with some pretty... 
this one. Fucking AI. You're already dead. You're dead. Fucking AI. See, I, I'm good at driving when I when I put a little bit of focus in. <laughs> this is the immediate next quarter. <laughs> Dude, I pressed the button. There we go. Oh, why are you, am I holding the micro SMG? Why do I even have that? My custom loadout is. Who? Oh, it's been impounded. Yay. Fuck's sake. It's on me on the other side of the fucking highway. Damn near almost swerved into me. No. I guess it must have been that guy that fucking annihilated me earlier.
Not that one. Yeah. Yeah, that's a dominator, it looks like. Has to be this one. Can it hook? But the last time I did this, it was hooked immediately. There we go. Okay. Oh no, buzzards. Oh, it, 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 they have the gun. They actually use the guns. Okay, that is a bit more of a problem, actually. Could you? Fucking not. Mid range car. I'm gonna make fucking nothing on that. Oh my god, the car is fucking wrecked. Fucking 16,000 in damage. Jesus Christ. Literally the worst I've ever done. And of course it's when I start recording. <laughs> Oh, God, that guy is um, like a million. Oh, I'm also talking into the game chat. I need to fix that.
Oh, the helicopters still exist. And there we go. All right, that car is registered on your Securo Serve account. Come by the office if you want to source another one. I will definitely do that. All right, let's go get my fucking car. I don't know why I didn't react at all. Like, I knew, like, as soon as I saw that car that I was going to hit it, and I did nothing. I mean, it is, like, like, ten past midnight. But still... Bastards, they knocked out one of my brake plates. Thank you.
Right. Game doesn't have any fucking hey. controls. All right. Now I am in a party. This will actually let me do a little experiment. So, okay. I'm currently in my party talking. Now if I mute my mic in the party. Oh, perfect. Okay, I still come through on stream. Perfect, that means I'll be able to fucking stream among us. Priorities. I need to mute my preview. Mission. There we go. Yeah, but, 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 but. Really, you want that one? Okay. Wait, really, you want that? Fucking hell. Terrible ca taste on these customers. Terrible fucking taste on these customers. They say with my fucking Hummer over there in the background. I really hate that flash. There we go. El Cuatro. Ugly. Oh, I never got around to installing the button. Since I've exited and now I'm re-entering my auto shop, I wonder if that glitch is going to happen or not. Um... For, for those that don't know, uh, in the auto shop, there is a glitch where it once you 
modify a vehicle for somebody. Um, uh, confirm delivery is no longer on my screen, so I think, yeah, we're good. Um, if, if, if you try and do this while confirm delivery is on your screen, it'll, uh, you'll just end up in an empty version of the, uh, auto shop in your car. There's no way out except to, um, like teleport to your facility or to respawn. Uh, where are the light covers? Where are the light covers? Clicking on fucking everything. Ah, here they are. I thought there was like a half version. I guess there isn't. Yeah, we'll leave normals. Uh, layout. All of them color red. There we go. <clears throat> uh, stream might go fucky for a second. I'm going to check my button mapping on my controller. Okay, well, that's annoying. Um, there is no way for me to map um, mute and unmuting my party uh, to a button on my Elite controller. It, it, it could do fucking everything. I can, I can send commands to turn my TV volume up or down, but I can't tell it to, like, mute or unmute my mic. Which means I have to fucking manually go into the menu and... That's just annoying. Hey, fucking $230 for this controller. It's like $100 more than I realistically had to spend at the time. And it can't, I can't even. Why did I go down? Yeah, seriously, I pay this much for a fucking controller that offers button mapping. I should be able to button map however the fuck I want. And be and it being able to do like literally fucking everything but the one thing I want it to. It's not part of That's not one of the exports. Okay. 
What is this car then? I'm not getting anything. This car is nothing. Another waste of time. Does the stream pause if I open my guide? No, it doesn't appear to. I'm gonna double check by unmuting my stream preview. Alright, so we're sitting here. I open my guide. Okay, my voice is still coming through. Oh, good. Vroom, vroom. Ah, fuck. Ah, fuck. Oh, no, I'm going to get VOD muted. Hell yeah, Stance Nation. Fuck, fuck being able to drive over speed bumps. I love driving impractical cars. I'm getting spicy over here with my opinions. But yeah, no, seriously, like fucking cars where they have like negative a million uh, camber on the wheels and they're so fucking low that like if the road has a tiny bump in it they rip their entire undercarriage like what what is that why <laughs> how big's it going to be it's going to be huge why would i'm the only one in the session neat Saber turbo. Okay, fine. <laughs> okay, the vehicle's been lent to a photographer for the day. Get past security, get the. It's not a road. I'm not going down that. Wait, hold on, hold on, wait, what the fuck, what the fuck? Okay, it was just a trick of the camera. I thought that, like, my rear wheels had way more negative camber than my front, which... No. <laughs> Why is it telling me to go? I know how to get to the fucking pier. I know better than you, GPS. Wait, how do I get to the pier? Right here. Oh, he's not actually on the pier. I can get down these stairs.
Where's the last hostile? Well, that didn't get him. Oh, apparently it did. Oh, apparently it, it didn't. <laughs> Bye. Fucking chopper. Last time I did this version, uh, the fucking helicopter, when I was going around a corner, a helicopter, like, flew into the side of a building and blew, mm, blew up. Fucking hilarious. It looks like it's actually done that a bit already. Why am I... AP pistol. Just fucking did it. <laughs> oh, fuck, I'm out of ice tea. I suppose I should take insulin for those pancakes. All right, that car is reg. There we go. Cool. Can you... I know what I'm doing right now is it's far from the most efficient money maker. But like, you know, I'm not on that hard grind right now. I'm just kind of chilling. I'm having fun. I'm trying to have fun. Fun is relative. Saved it. 
immediately fucking... I seriously never done this gang gang attack. All right. Accurate. Get some, motherfucker. Stupid fucking. We got wounded over here. Fuck you, stupid. Oh, I'm the asshole. You're the one shooting me. money we can make in 30 minutes an amount uh i don't know if you were here when i said it or not but um i'm not really going for money i'm just kind of chilling having fun most of my money making grind activities are solo anyway like ko pierco Tips for, for what? For KO Pierco or just in general? Or, or for like making money? I swear gang attacks are harder than they used to be. Remember years ago just being able to do these with a pistol. Uh with making money. Um well, yeah, the the easiest and quickest solo money making is uh is KO Pierco. Um but of course it does have a pretty high barrier for entry, meaning you need the Kwatska in the first place. That's seven fucking mil. However, um to to get the seven mil for the K for the K Pierco heist, um if you have Twitch Prime, if you link that, I not sure if it's still available, but I think you get a free nightclub. And uh and nightclubs uh you get all of the businesses. Um they're they're a decent source of income. Um, auto shop uh, contracts are, are pretty good. Um, although they're annoying because of how fucking horny, um, uh, the two characters are on the phone. Like, seriously, I wish I could mute. Oh, you have Kowatska. Sweet. Uh, yeah, K.O. Pierco. Uh, there's a specific route you can take through it. Uh, solo. Ah, god damn it. Um... Uh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, well, there, there's the initial, like, start heist. Uh, that's kind of like the story. 
once you once you get out that out of the, the way once you start replaying the heist um there's a specific route you can take um uh your entrance is the drainage tunnel it brings you straight into the compound and there's um as soon as you get into the compound you can basically just sprint yeah you did the story yeah once you once you're in the compound you can basically just sprint straight into the office uh and go down the elevator into the basement and get the main reward um and then you can on your way out to your whatever exit you want to do you can uh uh just grab stuff um How prepared am I in KOP Erko? Because if I if I have KOP Erko all prepared and done, I'll go do it. Um, the strategy I have only works uh, solo, but I I will I'll go do it and I'll basically just show it to you if you want. Where is this last guy? There he is. Uh, yeah, I think I have KO Pierco mostly set up. It's been a while since I grinded it. Stupid bucket. Where did you go? Oh, there you are. If uh, if you if you don't have time to like watch me go through it, um, just look up the the, the route that goes through the uh, for the drainage tunnel. Uh, it's really easy. Sorry, I, 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 j I don't work well with, uh, with other people, and, um, again, the, the, the route through K.O. Pierco is, it, it's a solo route. Have, having a second person there basically makes it impossible. But I'll do it right now on stream and show it to you. Shit, need to plug in my laptop. <laughs> uh, how much setup do I have? Oh, nothing. Okay, fun. At least I have the prep out of the way. For the, the scouting. I can't think. It all took a little bit of time to start talking.
Just call me a fucking peasant. Uh, I'm for for the heist. I'm only doing the minimum required prep because uh, I've done it so many times I can get through it undetected. But if you're not entirely sure what you're doing, I suggest you get the disruption done, um, so that you can uh, so that if you get detected, you're not basically fucked by the fact that they have good weapons and armor and helicopters. What the fuck is the plasma cutter? Check all the boxes. What what box am I missing? I I checked. Oh, you followed? Okay. Uh, the, uh, the VOD will be up. It was just 12. It's 12.44. What the fuck? Oh my god. Time. Time exists. not bothering to uh, refill my health because right now uh, death doesn't matter. It's more annoying for me to go refill my snacks. Ma'am? Thank you. Take it easy and kill the power. There has to be a surge. 
One of the most fucking annoying parts of this game. Waiting for dialogue before I can do things. No, I don't. I'm not really not here to be famous. No. I, I, I don't want to buy fucking followers. You're probably just the fucking bot. Bye. <laughs> Thank you. 
All right, next we get the plasma cutter, which I hate going to get. Oh, it's safe code this time around. Never mind, that's a lot easier. Less easier, more not as annoying. to bother her with it because well, I'm on a session on my own uh, but normally as I when I fly around in my sparrow I put my missiles on homing off um, because uh, I don't want to like lock onto a player or something and freak them out because uh, if if a player gets locked onto by a missile that might incentivate them incentivize, that's the word, uh, them to turn around and shoot me. I, I swear, like, probably 80% of the time someone kills me in this game, it's, it's someone doing a preemptive strike. Straight into it. People often leave trunk unlocked. Start there. Why the fuck? Okay. Look for his plates. I was correct. It was in the trunk, huh? It was either that or the cup holder. Now take the elevator to penthouse floor. There we are. Okay. Uh, ducking into cover so that I don't go through the animation of eating the snacks. Perfect. I could barely hear you. The people on the inside will have no idea. Fuck's sake. Oh, I can't wait until I get on next gen. The fucking load times are killing me. Don't forget the photograph. 
Fucking throws her cigarette on the ground before cowering in fear. There. There we go. Oh, they're dead. Have some fun. Let's use this. Security is all the way on the fucking other end this, this round. Also, something annoying. The game lit... Like, it... It doesn't let me shoot them. Which is really weird for this game. I am inside my own asshole. There we go. Did you find them? And the codes, yes? Now don't stick around. Get out and get away from the casino. I can only run so fast indoors. Fucking annoying. Uh. Why? Fine. It's Lester. I don't. Oh. I never actually tried calling him on on this before. Goodbye, police. That was almost disastrous.
All right, now let's get the weapons. That's my blood sugar doing. Okay. Going down. Good. Thank you. Fuck's sake. This loadout is my pers personal preference, but don't have to use it. Because I don't do um, the disruption to take away their body armor. Um, having the uh, armor piercing rounds is uh, useful. And we're... Going for the fucking Osprey instead of the office. Lovely. I honestly, I don't get this, like, line of logic. As I was saying, I don't, I don't get that line of logic where it's like, oh, you can't use your personal weapons or Ruby will trace it to you. And it's like, that's got to like only be an issue if, if I were to leave the weapon, because I, I can fucking guarantee you none of the weapons my character uses are, are fucking registered anyway. So it's not like they'd be able to trace it to me by like the the way the fucking bullet the, the the rifling on the on the bullet matches this specific serial number on the and like as long as i take the weapon off the island with me the only thing they'd be able to track is the ammunition spent like the the casings on the ground and and stuff like that in which case i don't need i don't need unregistered unmarked weapons i just need un, un untraceable ammunition and like all of my weapons are fucking unmarked untraced anyways i i, I just i don't get that line of logic it's just just rockstar giving us another thing we have to do And then they make one of the two variations of the mission 
one of the most fucking annoying things in the game because they have this very slow helicopter that very slowly flies across half of the fucking map. I'm not sure where it's going this time because the only, the only places I've seen it go is like over there um, or like uh, that that group of lights right there that we've passed. I don't know where where we're going this time. Don't know if they added a, a, a third location for the helicopter to go or if I've just never gotten this one before somehow. Jesus Christ, I can feel the fucking seconds of my life ticking away as I follow this goddamn Valkyrie. But we're going across the Alamo Sea. Uh, <laughs> okay. Alamo C, as far as I can tell, uh, brace, uh, braced, based off a real place, um, in, I believe it's California, uh, the Salton Sea, um, artificial lake, uh, accidentally created when some, um, agriculture efforts caused it to get flooded, and, uh, a bunch of resorts and stuff all popped up around it. Um, but because the only source of intake for the water, or the main source of intake for the lake, was, um, agriculture runoff, had a lot of salt in it. So slowly the, the, the salt and sea, uh, got very fucking salty. And all of the fish that they imported into it that up to that point have been thriving all the fucking mass died off and all of the resort towns kind of just died as uh, as there wasn't any real appeal in this uh, in this lake anymore in this uh, salt lake because uh, because all the fishing uh, went away and uh, and it fucking reeked. Uh, if you want to know more, uh, Veritasium has a uh, video on it. Yeah, I get that. Let me out. Thank you. Now I just need to fly across half the map back, but much quicker this time because I can move at full speed. And the sparrow is not slow. How fast is it? Uh, 130. 140. If 
About as fast as the oppressor, about as fast as the Hydra. So actually, yeah, that's fucking quick. my mic. Alright, now all that's left to do is get the radar jammer, or sonar jammer, uh, for the Kowatska. Uh, the Kowatska is the uh, en uh, entry vehicle that you need for... Oh, I meant to hit fast travel. Uh. Uh, yeah, in order to go through the drainage tunnel, you need the Kowatska, uh, as your approach vehicle. Uh, for me, this is the easiest way to go and get the radar jammer. I used to fly to it in the, uh, uh, Sparrow, but getting back proved to be annoying. So yeah, I just drive up in the Kowatska, use my uh, the periscope missiles to knock down the, uh, the helicopter and the boats.
Glad I don't have to pay for those. By doing this this way, I can swim straight back to the Kowatska and I don't have to deal with the fucking helicopters. Amazing. Never mind. Not still alive. That's yeah, not in the bridge. Oh, wait, no, it is in the bridge. I'm blind. What the fuck did my camera just do? Stop getting stuck on doors. Oh my god. And all necessary prep is complete. So yeah, now we're now we're ready to go start it. We take the Kowatska. We go drainage tunnel. Drainage tunnel. Uh, I like to leave by the main dock. Night is obviously just better. No support crew needed. None of them can fucking do anything unless you take out the, uh, the air defense, which is on the other side of the island, so. I don't even go to that entire half of the island, so it doesn't matter. A 
acquired. I have your location. Once you are inside the compound, I will be able to see you on CCTV. You know what I like about Fucking spam A for maximum swim. Fuck happened to my frame rate. Okay, there we go. Okay, next stop, maintenance. You really don't have to leave it on for long, like literally as soon as the glow goes away. Thank you. And there we go. Excellent. Did I ever tell you about the sewers in my hometown? It was there I first decided to join the Navy. Perhaps it will have the same effect on you. We will see. Off you go. And we're in the compound. Immediately turn around, run around this way. Are you in? You did not get sucked into a turbine. Ah, I knew you'd be fine. How likely is it I have and then you can just in the same way, huh? Now we look for the go along like this. Anda por aquí. Lo vi hace un rato. Grab the keys. You're in the area where Mr. Rubio's personal bodyguards operate. These men will know every soldier under their command. No disguise will fool them. Ah, there's a painting in the office. Let's grab this. Now I gotta do a fun little mini game. Okay, the fingerprint scanner. Time to break out the tool we borrowed from the head of cybersecurity. Remember, it picks up fragments of previous scans. You just have to cycle through them to match the target print. El Rubio is bored of executing employees. The cutting torch uh, burns the lock. It's silent. Uh, forty ninety five thirty seven. We have the combination. Just take your time. That's ninety five. Ninety five. What the fuck?
94. What the fuck am I on about? There's also a safe here. There's some money in it. Now, if you didn't happen to pick up the keys, you can loop around that way. And this cutscene. Given that canonically, like, you keep robbing him again and again, it just really doesn't make sense to be, for the character to be confused again and again and again about the fucking gate. Now, um, if I don't get a painting, I go over here to pick up uh, goods from there, but I did get the painting, so I'm going straight to the docks. Uh, and grabbing the secondary loot there. Um, usually at the docks there's enough secondary loot to fill your bag, but not always, so if I don't have the painting, I, I loop over to the right and grab it there, and then head to the docks. To a bit further to the right than I normally do, for some reason. Uh, that's where you're wrong, Mr. Rubio. Yeah, see what I mean? Not a lot of secondary loot here. Weed, not cocaine. It's not going to fill my bag. Fuck. I'm going to have to go hit the other one over uh, to the west. No, east. Never eat soggy wafer. Yeah, east. Shit. I legitimately have not been... Yeah. Yeah, oops. Oh, 
you fucking Oh my god. Oh Fuck, well there goes my elite challenge. Die! Oh my... Wasn't getting the elite challenge anyway. Quick restart doesn't fucking matter. Uh. That's still annoying though. Do it fucking right this time. There it is. That took us. That took longer than normal. It was weird. Usually, yeah, he, he usually just starts screaming as soon as I get past the gate. The reason I uh, got detected last round was um, I couldn't see the guy's vision code against the map properly. I don't know if if uh, anybody else had a problem with that or if it was just me. Bag spawns in. Yeah, like I, I'm, I'm having trouble seeing his vision cone on the map. I can see it this time. I know it's. Uh, 
He didn't see it. Okay. I legitimately cannot see the vision cone of the, the fucking guy on the corner over there. Of course there's fucking cocaine over on this one. That's a decent haul. Still bummed about the uh uh elite reward. reason I killed the one guy on the dock is because um he's actually like killed me uh while I was pulling out uh on my escape before so I used to not kill him and it ne was never a problem, but then that one time he'd fucking pinpoint accuracy me. <laughs> yeah yeah i know it's like go through all the trouble to get like fucking custom guns uh or not custom guns but like unlicensed guns and all of that shit meanwhile go into the mission don't even fucking wear gloves fingerprints fucking everywhere The secret bound. Uh, I'm gonna have to pay attention in future future ones to see if it does that there as well. Much richer now, so. Nope. There we go. Time to wear a suit. And randomly punch the air. Yeah, 2.8. It's been a while since I've sat down and properly grinded. It's been a while since I've need to.
I don't know what that means. Yeah, I get it now. Okay. Yeah, seriously, what even is the economy in this in this universe? Because things seem to either cost way more than they should, or way less than they should. Speaking of snacks. The, there we go. Excuse me. Hello. Yeah. Phase out the least, but I don't like the other two. <laughs> oh no, of course we can't buy buy armor in our in our underground facility with the orbital death cannon or 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 our literal bunker where we manufacture weapons. Of course we can't. What's up, boss? Because Rockstar hasn't heard of uh this concept called um updating their previous content. Camera at my car's ass.
Oh yeah, I like driving cars. Like I always, I I like having the uh, the sparrow. Sparrow makes things fun and easy, especially when doing prep for uh, KOP Erko. Um, and I always have the oppressor on standby uh, in case I gotta get somewhere real fucking quick. But if I'm not in a hurry, or sometimes even if I am in a hurry, but it's not like not too far away. Yeah, I like driving. I like driving in this game. Toreador, is that one of the ones that flies? Let me run. There we go. Ah. Right with the torpedoes, right? And uh, Doomsday Heist. Or is that a different under? I, a lot of the higher tier vehicles in this game, I, I just have no idea because I don't bother with them. Excuse me? There we go. Fucking hitboxes. Why am I running like this? Gay little run. <laughs> me, me going to, to the kitchen at 3 a.m. for snacks. Uh, yeah, yeah, okay. Oh, Ignis has active arrow. Does it? Was that a trick of the light? I think that was a trick of the light. That U turn was illegal. Or maybe it wasn't. I don't know the fucking traffic laws in this in this state. Why my max health go up? It was my max health was already at max. I this game sometimes been playing since 2014 and it's all right. There it is. Okay, let's go pay to get the high set up so I get the hard mode bonus whenever I decide to do it next.
Nice wheels I have. This is a helicopter. That I apparently can't fly. Oh yeah. K.O. Pirico is my favorite heist, just purely for the fact I could do it solo. Also, K.O. Pirico exists in this strange space where it's actually better to do it solo unless you have a full squad of four. And even then, it might still be better to do it solo because if you have a full squad of four, the amount of imagine <laughs> playing with friends uh, yeah. I mean, I have a couple of friends that play the game, but like, I've done the casino heist a few times, um, once with friends and, uh, a couple of times with randos and Holy fuck, when I can actually, like, trust and communicate with people properly, it goes so much easier. Captain, what do you think Mr. Rubio is doing right now? If you listen very carefully... Uh, do I actually want to go scout it right now, or... Nah. Oh, I, I, hello. <laughs> okay. Uh, no, I, I try and communicate and just, I get nothing. And, and sometimes you get them like, it's almost as if they intentionally try and sabotage it and, and fuck it up. Yeah. You're through to your garage. You uh, need me to bring you a ride? Right, 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 right. It's coming at you. I, right, I'll get back to work. Hardest part about. Uh, enjoying driving everywhere is choosing what car to drive. that oh wait no i did want that never walked up to the building while someone else was in it before like literally been playing this game for how many fucking years 20 2014 Boss. and i still get confused by the simplest of things simply because i've never ran into them before Uh, 
Decent. You get the you get the occasional griefer, but um most most players tend to either mind their own business or uh or you know, just killed each other down there, but like Grief griefers only seem to to pop up and become an issue uh if you invite them to become an issue. If that makes why am I over here? All right. Yep. Also, something interesting I've noticed. Um, a lot of lobbies I end up in where there is a griefer. Um, you'll actually get, uh, get like, anti-griefers popping up. Um, but most of the time I tend to get killed by other players in this game. It, it, it seems to be less a griefer situation and more like a preemptive strike. Which, that, that, that annoys me because it's just the general atmosphere of sus suspicion. Yeah, me too. Me too. I, I, I like... I like PvP in this game, but like, I like proper PvP where where you're where you're playing fair and not like just dicking people over for and and it's fun for you, but for them you're just some asshole. That's up there. Okay. What's KDR? Yeah. Um, it, something something I I wish the game would do though is like have have like things that incentivized PvP, but like in a in a in a oh okay. Um, yeah, now that I think about it, that term, yeah, that, KDR, yeah, that makes sense. Um, uh, but I, I like to see things, I'd like to see things that incentivize PvP, but in a, in a more interesting way than what's already, because, like, delivering cargo and, and, like, you get, and PvP happens. Hmm, mm-hmm. mm -hmm. Um, but like, what I'm doing right now, I'm bringing the, a, a car to the warehouse and I go deliver a car. Like, PvP there is just kind of annoying. It's like, because like, I would actually mind less if there was more incentive. But like, you go blow up someone's nightclub shipment, you get like $2,000. And it, it's it's like 
literally the only reason people would ever come fuck with your shit while, while you're on a delivery or something is to be a dick because you legitimately don't get anything out of it. And, and I think that's, that's what annoys me the most. Yeah. Yeah, exactly. We're adding that card. And especially with the oppressor mark too, like there's there like even like, like, there's nothing you can fucking do to, like, protect against it. Like, you just, just fucking rockets from, from the other side of the fucking map come in, blow you up. Like, that's not fair. That's not fun. No one's looking for that place. Wouldn't recognize it. Uh, I think the only, like, free roam PvP event that, like, that, like, going around and, like, just shooting other players okay. and, and, like, actually Take having PvP with is, um, get... business battles. Because you go grab the piece of cargo and you, you, you die trying to get it back to your nightclub. Like, you don't lose anything. You don't lose like a, a one million dollar shipment. You don't you don't lose an investment. It, you just respawn and oh look, you can go go get it back. Fuck. Yeah, the oppressor is is it is it is an amazing vehicle but I uh and it's very useful but it's just I don't like using it because sometimes people will just fucking shoot me down just for being on an oppressor because of the reputation it's it's gained I purposely fly around with my uh my missiles homing turned off so that I don't lock onto people and, and freak them out because like I, I've had oppressor players, not not gunning for me, but they've just flown overhead, and I've had like the the missile tone go off, and it's, I've fucking the the panic that causes. And I don't wanna, I don't wanna cause that to other players, so I so I fly around with my with my missile lock turned off. Yeah, the beeping noise, the fucking, the panic of the beeping noise. Yeah, even even when I'm not in in my oppressor, when I'm in anything that has has missiles, I uh, I like to keep the the lot the the. the the homing turned off until I actually need it. Uh, 
I'm going to it. Should have used the knife instead of the hatchet. Uh, not my best delivery. It's 10 past 2 in the morning. I've been streaming for two and a half hours. I should probably go to bed. <laughs> yeah, I'm going End my stream here. Head to bed. Uh, nice, uh, nice chatting with you. Uh, paid? Is that, is that how, how you, Pedro? How you say it? I've never actually seen the name Pedro spelled before, so I'm going to assume. <laughs> make an ass out of myself. this in an attempt to make sure stuff saves because that's annoying oh hello you're joining me literally as i'm ending the stream <laughs> Because it's 10 past 2 and I need to get to bed. What do you mean, wait, what? I thought it was pretty clear on that. It's, it's, it's 10 past 2 in, in the morning in my time zone and I need to get to bed. I, uh, I was just switching sessions so it would save. Right. Uh, yeah, and this is where 5 p.m. for you. Yeah, time zones. Yeah. I'm a... Uh, and and here. This was.